Is it the right time to make a decision about super microcomputer stock? Let's dive deep into it. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, January 18, 2024. Now, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Make sure to stay updated on our latest analysis by subscribing, hitting the like button, and turning on the notification bell. Stay informed about any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Access the power of AI and get free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since January 4, 2024, our system has ranked Super Microcomputer as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of 0.09. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. During this period, the stock has outperformed our expectations, with a gain of 7.84% since we first recommended buying Super Microcomputer 10 days ago. This translates to an average return of 0.78% per day since it was listed as hold slash accumulate. The stock is currently in the midst of a strong upward trend, indicating the potential for further growth. Based on the three-month trend, there is a projected 26.32% change in the next three months, with potential returns ranging from 16.40% to 42.33%. Looking at the 12-month trend, there is a forecasted 120.72% change over the next year, with potential returns between 99.97% and 232.6%. This corresponds to a price range of $622.80 to $1,035.85 after one year. Our latest update on Super Microcomputer brings you the headline, Super Microcomputer stock price ended at $311.44 on Thursday, with a decrease of 2.13%. On the last day, Thursday, January 18, 2024, the stock price of Super Microcomputer fell by 2.13%, moving from $318.23 to $311.44. This marks the fourth consecutive day of decline. Throughout the trading day, the stock experienced a fluctuation of 8.97%, reaching a low of $306.52 and a high of $334. Over the past two weeks, there has been a 10.97% increase in the stock price, with some ups and downs. Although the trading volume increased by 620,000 shares on the last day, it occurred alongside falling prices. This could be an early warning sign, slightly increasing the risk in the upcoming days. In total, approximately 4 million shares were bought and sold, amounting to around $1.30 billion. Looking at the past 52 weeks, the stock reached its highest price at $357.99, while its lowest price was $69.02. Currently, the stock price is 13% or $46.55 below the 52-week high of $357.99, which also marks the all-time high for this stock. Welcome to today's video on Analyst Ratings. Let's dive into some recent updates on SMCI's Analyst Ratings. On Wednesday, August 23, 2023, Wedbush gave SMCI a neutral grade with an upgrade action. Moving on to Thursday, August 10, 2023, Susquehanna also gave SMCI a neutral grade but with a hold action. Back on Wednesday, June 7, 2023, Rosenblatt Securities had a positive outlook for SMCI, giving it a buy grade with an initialize action. Let's go back in time to Friday, August 12, 2022, when Susquehanna gave SMCI a positive grade with a hold action. Going further back to Tuesday, April 26, 2022, Zach's Investment Research also had a positive view on SMCI, giving it a buy grade with an upgrade action. Analysts have given Super Micro Computer Stock a general buy rating. They consider the P-E ratio a strong buy and the price to book as strong buy. When it comes to return on investment, the analysts give the stock a rating of neutral. Today, we'll be analyzing the signals for super microcomputer stock.
In the short term, the moving average indicates a sell signal. However, the long-term average shows a buy signal. Since the short-term average is above the long-term average, this gives a positive forecast for the stock, suggesting a general buy signal. If the stock continues to gain, it may encounter resistance at around $332.14 from the short-term moving average. On the other hand, if the stock falls, it may find support at approximately $294.71 from the long-term average. Keep in mind that a breakup through the short-term average will trigger a buy signal, while a breakdown through the long-term average will trigger a sell signal. Additionally, the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD, indicates a buy signal. However, there have been some negative signals that could impact the stock's near short-term development. On Tuesday, January 9, 2024, a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point, resulting in a 9.39% decrease in the stock's value so far. It is likely to continue falling until a new bottom pivot is identified. It's worth noting that volume increased during the recent price decline, which could be an early warning sign. It would be wise to closely monitor the stock's performance. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. One signal worth noting is the moving average convergence divergence, which indicates a buy signal. Another signal to consider is the pivots, which suggests a sell signal 7 days ago. Bollinger signals a buy signal 82 days ago. The short-term moving average indicates a sell signal 4 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average also suggests a sell signal 12 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages shows a buy signal 23 days ago. If we analyze the 12-month chart, we observe the short moving average indicating a sell signal 12 days ago. On the other hand, the long-term moving average presents a buy signal 24 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages demonstrates a buy signal 29 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Super Micro Computer Let's talk about the support levels for Super Micro Computer. Currently, the stock finds support just below today's level at $293.87 and $255. When a stock tests a support level, there is a natural risk involved. If this support is broken, the stock may fall to the next support level. In this case, the next support levels for Super Micro Computer are at $293.87, $255, and $245.90. It's important to note that this stock is considered high risk due to its volatility. It can experience significant movements during the day. Additionally, the Bollinger Band indicates a large prediction interval, adding to the risk. In the last day, the stock had a $27.48 difference between its high and low, which is about 8.97%. Over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 6.7%. Before we discuss the potential trading levels for Super Micro Computer, let's go over some important fundamental data. First, let's talk about the price-to-earnings ratio, also known as the P-E ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per share earnings. Super Micro Computer has a relatively normal P-E ratio, which is often seen in companies with established track records and stable revenues. Moving on to other news, the next earnings report for Q4 2023 is expected to be released on January 30, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for the earnings per share are at $4.57. It's important to keep an eye on these numbers as they can significantly impact stock prices. Today, we'll be discussing some potential day trading levels for Super Micro Computer. In the case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Super Micro Computer is at $322.19. If you're not currently holding any shares, it might be wise to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. However, if you're already holding the stock, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. On the downside, Super Micro Computer encounters its first support level at $293.87. If this support level holds, it could present a good entry point, with the potential for a rebound. The combined average rating for Super Micro Computer from multiple analyst sources is a buy. Now, let's dive into some recent insider trades. 
On January 2, 2024, Fairfax Daniel W. conducted an insider sell, offloading 300 shares of common stock. On December 6, 2023, Lao Yishayan Wali made an insider buy of zero shares of common stock. On December 6, 2023, Lao Yishayan Wali made an insider buy of zero shares of common stock. On December 6, 2023, Lao Yishayan Wali made an insider buy of zero shares of common stock. On December 6, 2023, Lao Yishayan Wali made an insider buy of 15,000 shares of employee stock option, right to buy. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 29.843. Overall, insiders purchased 534,043 shares and sold 262,910 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $296.30, which is a decrease of 4.86% from the current price. This particular stock experiences significant daily movements, making it a high-risk investment. We have identified a sell signal from a pivot top that occurred six days ago. Is Super Microcomputer stock worth investing in? While Super Microcomputer shows some positive signals, we don't believe they are strong enough to make it a buy candidate. It would be wise to hold or accumulate shares at the current level and wait for further development. Our analysis indicates that the current price is undervalued based on recent volatility and movements in the market. For trading on Friday, January 19, we anticipate Super Microcomputer to open with a gain of $5.88, starting at $317.32. Before we dive into the content, it's crucial to acknowledge that trading comes with a high risk of financial loss. It's strongly recommended to consult a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Remember, StockInvest.us serves as an informative platform and should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you accept full responsibility for your own investment actions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we're going to take a closer look at the current view of this stock. We're eager to hear your thoughts, so don't forget to comment below and share your opinions. What do you think is the target for this stock? Like and subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. We hope you have a successful trading day and a beautiful day ahead. Regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.